Hey everybody, it's Fran Harris coming at you with a follow-up Facebook tip. Don't forget to hit me back on the blog, FranHarrisCoaching.com, and let me know how you're using these tips, and also don't be afraid to share your own strategies and tactics and tips with the community as well, FranHarrisCoaching.com. So one of the questions I usually get is, Fran, how are, you, how are you using Facebook? What are some of the things that you post on Facebook, and what should I be posting on Facebook? So this video is going to basically focus on one tactic. And it may be one of those tactics where you're like, oh, I never thought about that. Or, good, that's exactly what I'm doing. But I'm telling you, this is a single strategy that you need to really come out of the gate strong with to help you build your community on Facebook. And it is very simple. Here it is. You ready? Lean in. Help somebody. That's it. Help somebody. I see a lot of people using Facebook to debate, okay, that's one way you can do it, that's certainly one way to do it, but if you're going back to the first thing I shared with you in video one is that it's got to be about creating community, and one way to create, create community is to make sure that you're helping people. So for instance, over the last year and a half, we literally are launching this fall about 57, 60 blogs, six zero. You did hear me right, six zero blogs. All right, and so I've learned a lot. I've learned a lot about WordPress. I've learned a lot about which plugins I need. So one of the things that I'll probably be posting in Facebook very soon is kind of like my top 25 list of plugins that you should have on your WordPress blog. Now let me tell you why that is so helpful. We spent a lot of time figuring out what functionality we wanted FranHarris.com to have, what functionality we wanted FranHarrisTV.com to have, what functionality we wanted Fran Harris Basketball to have. So we've searched, I would say, 500 plugins, and the plugin, for those of you who aren't familiar, are just little gadgets and widgets and things that make your blog or your website more effective and efficient. So you could have a, a, a plugin that adds a little note at the bottom of each of your posts that says report a broken link. That's a plugin. It just makes your blog more effective. Or you can have a plugin that updates your blog every three hours. That's a plugin. So imagine how much time you would save if I gave you my list of top 25 plugins for a blog, for a WordPress blog. It would save you tons of time and tons of money. Now, when I post that white paper to Facebook, that's going to help a lot of people. All right? I'm not trying to make money. There's nothing wrong with making money. But my point is, when you get on Facebook, help people. Help them solve a problem, right? Can you see how helping someone solve a problem would endear them to the point that they would probably buy something from you, okay? It's not devious, it's not diabolical, it's just the way of the world. People who help people don't have a hard time getting those people to at least take a look at what they have to sell. So my motto is, I'm not using Facebook as my sole source of income. What I attempt to do at least once a week is to post something that will help somebody. Sometimes it's just a quote. Sometimes it's just a nice, a favorite quote of mine or an adage that really has changed my life. Like I posted something from Dr. D uh, Wayne Dyer a couple of weeks ago that said, if you change the way you look at things, the things you look at changed. I got lots of people who responded to that. That helped people. So you just want to help people, put things on there that truly help people make their lives better, make their businesses better. And those people will remember that. And guess what? Pretty soon when you post something, hey, I'm launching a new product. Well, I mean, we've got tons of products that we're going to launch over the next quarter. And I'm going to promote them on Facebook, absolutely, because I know what they've done for my business. I know what they've done for my life. And believe me, if they've had that kind of impact on me, there's a chance they will have that kind of impact on you. But it starts from a very pure place, and that is, I want to help people. I want to make your life better. I want to make your business better. So I'm going to post a combination, a balance of things that make your life better and make your business better. But don't forget, the way to really grow your community is to help people. I'll see you in the next video. Take it care.